Hello and welcome to this very important day in the Christian calendar, a day that we call Good Friday, which always seems a bit of a strange title when something so sad happened. But as Christians, thankfully, we know that's not the end of the story. And so we come with our next egg. I wonder what could be inside. Let's take a look. We have the symbol of Christianity, the cross, the cross on which Jesus died. And we will find out how that happened in our next part of Bob Hartman's Rhyming Bible. This story is called When Jesus ha Hung Upon the Cross. When Jesus hung upon the cross, his hands and feet nailed to the wood, he saw the men who hated him laughing at them where they stood. Priests and rulers, one and all, some were jealous, some were afraid. If you were God's son, they mocked, save yourself and leave this place. When Jesus hung upon the cross, a crown of thorns jammed on his head. He saw the soldiers gambling for what little clothing he had left. He could have given hate for hate, or curse the soldiers hammer blows. Instead, he said, Father, forgive. What they have done, they do not know. When Jesus hung upon the cross, he saw his mother's tears flow down. He watched her grief and agony as she knelt, weeping on the ground. John, he called, disciple, friend, take my mother home with you. Treat her like she's your mum now. Do for her what I would do. When Jesus hung upon the cross, two thieves hung with him, left and right. He heard one thief call, save us now, if you really are the Christ. We're guilty, said the other thief. This man does not deserve to die. You'll be with me in paradise, said Jesus to him in reply. When Jesus hung upon the cross, his tongue hard, swollen, lips cracked dry. He croaked, I thirst, and then he saw a sponge upon a branch raised high. He wet his lips with sour wine, and as he saw the darkness fall, he cried, it is finished. And then he died for you and me for one and all.